Welcome to Winsouls TV. This is your host Jeff Thomas, and today I was actually going to make another video concerning something else entirely, but as I about an hour ago the Lord let me know that he wanted me to literally let you guys know about two specific books in terms of interpreting your dreams. Um, it is really important that that we are able to interpret our dreams that we're able to understand what the Lord is trying to say to us because as you guys probably already know more than two-thirds of the entire Bible was written off of dreams and visions so the Lord speaks to us through dreams and visions and so if it is that that is one of the avenues that he's using to speak to us versus literally invading our thoughts and just telling us specific things then we don't want to miss any opportunities to understand what the Lord is trying to say to us in that season, in that time, and especially during this crazy time right now. OK, and so with that said, we need to be able to interpret those dreams. And one of one of the books that, that I use or that he led me to to use is called The Prophet's Dictionary by Paula A. Price. OK, and literally like you can look up all of the specific components of the things that were happening in your dream so uh, I'll just share a dream with you so like the other night right um, as you guys can tell I, I cannot grow a beard to save my life okay like this is I mean you know I got I got peach fuzz alright I'm 31 years old that's about as far as I got okay and I really doubt that I'm really going to have this full length beard, hairy, burly dude. OK, I'm not a lumberjack. All right. I, it just does not grow for me. All right. I got a baby face. So with that said, in the dream, I was looking at myself in the mirror and all I mean, all of this was just filled in, filled in. And it was like plickety plows. It was like nice and trim and everything looked really 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 good okay and I remember talking to my mom in the dream and I was like man I could never grow you know this like this before like man I, you know I feel really really good like I, I look good in the mirror and blah 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 and then I woke up and then I rolled over and the first book that I came in contact with was God's prophetic symbolism in everyday life by Adam Thompson and Adrian Beal and I'll put these down in the description uh, below but what it was saying about a nice trimly cut beard a nice really good looking beard was you are coming into a place of maturity with the Lord okay and so the Lord was basically letting me know like hey there's coming a time that you are beginning to embrace now and I may be already in that time. The, the one thing that you'll still need guidance from the Lord concerning like, you know, what's actually going on. But these will give you like the blueprints of, OK, this is what is generally said. And this is reference to it in the Bible. OK. And so with that said, I really hope that it's a blessing to you. I'm not going to make this video any longer than it needs to be. Uh, the Lord just wanted me to let you guys know that. It is really important to be able to interpret our dreams. It is really important to write those dreams down or record them in my case. Um, you know, I'm, I haven't been the best advocate of recording them all of the time, but I'm just going to be honest. But um, it's really important to have that. OK, we don't want to miss anything that the Lord has to say. And I just leave that to you guys. You guys be blessed. I hope you get the books. I hope you begin to understand what the Lord is saying to you. And I hope that from now on, um, you won't miss any other dreams or anything that the Lord is trying to show you. You guys be blessed. Goodbye.